So, you know, right now, man, I'm I'm at the point where it's like you you're you're just coming to your to to the your own and you're trying to figure out who is against you and who is for you. You know. If you don't know that, I mean, that's that's a major major step in into figuring out who you are and what this world is truly about, the matrix that you're stuck in, and who is really on your side and on your team trying to uh benefit from what you have and what you're 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 trying to give, you know, and not trying to take advantage of you and make you a slave again you know and you could usually you could usually find those people that are like you like minded that want to do those things and and they are willing to fight for it there's a lot of people that's not willing to fight for it and they're not willing to take a look into the mirror and say yo there's something wrong and and, and those that you know are willing to say it but still not willing to take action you still have to get away from those people as well because once they once once you are established then they could come in and then learn the proper way but they're not you know they're not the people that you want to build with at in any case or any time because at any time they will fall back into the system in hard times in hard times as soon as they start getting persecuted or or you know the system starts you know coming after them or talking negative about them they fold like lawn chairs and you don't you don't want to be around people like that you want to be around strong people that want to see the best for the future right like like it, that's important that's important and i'm I'm a full believer in just the truth of all spiritual aspects of life from um, christianity islam hinduism um Zurian nationalism um buddhist buddhism um just anything that will take you into the reality of life and out of the matrix of cycles because there's a larger cycle and we want to be a part of that larger cycle this is what the mayans brought out you know the small wheel then the big wheel and then the bigger wheel and if you're not if you don't pay attention to to those those things and you are still stuck in the I want to be um I want to be a good Christian. I want God to love me and just take care of me and make sure that I have everything to to to, to so I could go into heaven. Those type of people you don't want to be around at all, man. And you know people will be like, "Yo, but you put a lot of you put a lot of racist stuff online." See, this is the thing, right? I'm not putting racist things online. I'm putting you online. I'm putting the mirror of who you are online. What your thoughts are online. And then you are in turn looking at it as if it's not you. But it's me that is making you have these feelings. <laughs> right? It's, it's, it's clearly not me. That makes that that makes you have these feelings, or make you have these uh, scary thoughts. <laughs> oh, oh my God, he's talking about the great white hope. Am I though? Am I? Am I? Am I? That's where a lot of people get lost, man. And it's a is it's a. It's a, it's a it's a sad thing because people don't even want to take a look at who they truly are, you know, because they're afraid of backlash. They're afraid that they might get killed. They're afraid that 
the truth won't set them free as per se to what this world truly is, you know, and I commend anybody that takes the time to actually learn who they are and and stand on it and stand on it. You know, if you don't learn who you are and you're not working to to fight for who you are and, and, and stand on it, then you're just like one of those uncle ass Tom niggas that don't want to fight for freedom. <laughs> That's just point blank, period. You know, and once people you once people put that in your face of the reality that they're truly in and they are still afraid to uh uh partake in the reality of 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 life and what it really means to be in this matrix of cycles where you wake up brush your teeth go to work come home go to sleep i mean yeah you can add in food and, and tv and and all that shit but that shit is not the cycle. It's part of the cycle because it keeps you in the matrix because it fills up your time. But it is is the the real cycle is face is work. Cons- consuming your free time, that's what it is. Consuming your free time so that you can never uh uh get get to the next level. You know, because people would tell me they they'd be like, "Man, you going you going too damn hard, bro. You going too damn hard." And I'm like, "Listen, man, I, I'm going as hard as the Most High allows me to go, and and, and trust that. <laughs> trust that, man. I, I'm 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 not I'm, I'm not I'm not taking it lightly. <laughs> you know, what I'm saying I'm really trying to break the back off this motherfucker. You know, that's just real." That's just real. I'm trying to break the back off this motherfucker. I want this whole shit to go away so that we could be free. We could smoke weed. We could drive to New York if we want to. No license. Nobody telling us how to uh, conduct ourselves day to day. No money worrying. Yo, listen, listen. All right. So you got 18 million houses, right? 18 million houses vacant in america 18 million then you have i think 3 million homeless people now you tell me if we need a motherfucking call uh motherfucking jobs (laughs) there's enough work on this planet for everybody because you have to take care of you see if we're taking care of others we're not taking care of ourselves right And then that takes away from our children because we have to secure the future. And if you're not securing the future, you're worse than an infidel. You're worse than an infidel. The scriptures tell you that. It tells you, yo, hey, you got to take care of your family. Anybody that don't work, don't eat, don't eat. Anybody that don't take care of his family is worse than an infidel. Right? This is... This is pure shit. This is pure crack that I'm giving out. I don't have to sell crack to give you crack. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? I don't have to um, smoke weed on, on TV or on, on live or anywhere to get you high. You get what I'm saying? Because that's the next level. Most of y'all are still brushing your teeth with that fluoride shit that they put in, the, in, in, uh, in Detroit. Right? Flint, Michigan. My fault. Not Detroit. Flint, Michigan. But they ain't got no drinking water because of the fluoride. But you still brushing your teeth with it, talking about, oh, this nigga crazy for not brushing his teeth with that shit. See, we look at reality and then we don't apply it to ourselves. We don't apply it to ourselves. This is why I don't think in the conception or or, or in the in the vein of the way that everybody else thinks, because I'm past that bullshit. I'm past that bullshit, bruh. Niggas be like, yo, you, you, listen, man. You got to go get a job, man. You got to get a job, man. If you don't get no goddamn job, man, you're going to fail in life. I'm 
like, listen, man, if you think that money makes me happy or is the, 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 the catalyst to happiness, you're crazy. Money is just a, a tool in this world for power. And how do you get money? I'm not even going to share that right now. I'm going to wait to another podcast. I'm going to share that in another podcast where people can actually will actually hear it. This one is just, <laughs> you know, this is just me giving myself over to you so that you know who I am and what I'm about. Like Kanye West was 100% right in this day and time. You're choosing slavery in this day and time. You are choosing not to look at what Iran is doing, North Korea, China, Russia, Europe, America, Venezuela, Cuba. You are choosing not to look at those things. And then you're putting that stereotype of what you think on your mind on everybody else. And that is an asshole move. Because I don't think no way about nothing. I could, yo, I can talk to a white person I could talk to an Arab, I could talk to an Indian, I could talk to a Chinese about anything. I I don't care. I don't care. But when it comes to my people, they only want to talk about basketball, girls, clubs, music, Cardi B, Azalea Banks, gays, clothes, shoes socks but they don't want to talk about free energy or what um elon musk is doing you know what i'm saying oh that's that's too deep bro that that's too deep that's too far nah nigga i'm fucking 31 right now i'm 31 right and i'm looking at life like what the fuck is these motherfuckers doing 31 years went by super quick Another 30 years is going to go by quick, too. I'm going to go to sleep tonight, right? And I'm going to wake up 30 years from now. Not literally. (laughs) Not literally. I'm just saying. That's how it feels. It's like a blink blink of time. Right? Because I could think back when I was 15, high as hell, driving around, smoking in the car. Hoping I don't get passed, uh, uh, pulled over by the police and go to jail. You know, I could go back to that time mentally like that. Like that. But you sit and you tell people these things and you try to, you know, show them the true understanding of the world and how everything is real from the scriptures and from the Vedas, Hinduism is the Vedas, um, Zurian Nationalism, and they look at you like, that's not Jesus. (laughs) That's not Jesus. That's not Jesus. What? Do you know Jesus? Did you meet him? Did you talk to him? Did you read did you read what he was saying? Did you read the Nagamati text? Did you read him? <laughs> but you you quick to tell me you ain't Christian. You ain't a follower of God. <laughs> That's hilarious. That's hilarious, man. It's hilarious. But this is just the next step of the evolution of man, you know what I mean? And um I'm proud of it, man. I'm proud of it. I'm happy. I'm glad that we I'm I'm getting to see the two worlds one falling away, one 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 raising up. And it's a beautiful time, man, and um I'm glad. I'm I'm glad that um I'm I'm doing that. And and I'm I'm able to see it. This is what a lot of the prophets wish they had seen. And this is another thing about the prophets too, right? This is another thing about the prophets. The scriptures say only the children of Israel will have prophets. Wait, did you hear me? Only the children of Israel, only the children of Shem, 
only them will have prophets. Ham's children are not going to have prophets. So at the time it was it was Shem, his children, and then the bloodline changes and it goes down to Abraham. Then the bloodline changes again, it goes down to Isaac. Then the bloodline changes again. When I say change, I'm talking about progresses as it moves forward. Uh, it goes to Isaac, then Jacob, and then from Jacob, 12 sons, and they all are here to this day. Dark skin, light skin, whatever. I don't, I don't see, I don't care about the skin color shit. <laughs> like, I don't give a fuck. Like, as long as you understand the time and you understand what I'm talking about and understand that we are here to move forward I'm good with it I'm good with it I'm good with you I'm good with what you think how you move and I don't care you know so I'm doing these probably once a week well I'm gonna probably do one every two three days um, cause I gotta get this stuff off my brain, man, and, and get it to people where they are fucking with it. Yes, the Furious Truth Podcast. I got two other people that's gonna be a part of it. You're gonna see them. That's gonna take a little time, but it's not gonna take that much time. D- don't get crazy. Don't get crazy. But they're gonna be on it. Um, we're gonna have a lot of interviews trying to get the up and coming Orlando artists. Um, yeah, man. I'm going to get a Patreon um, so that those artists could get paid, you know, for they, 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 uh, they work, man. Um, exclusive stuff. I'm going to try to get that going. Um, just fuck with me, man. And I'm going to take you to the next level. Um, I'm trying to, you know, go from state to state, meet a lot of the brothers that are doing courageous work from the Moors, the Hebrews, the RBG Hebrews. The Old Testament Hebrews, um, any comedic brothers that understand the truth, the real truth, not no oh you stole your, the Bible stole from the, the from 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 um, artists. I'm trying to get and, and 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 vloggers, man. I'm trying to get vloggers and just fuck with me, man. We're gonna take this to the next level. So yo. I'm furious black. Um, and we about to take it to the next level, man. <laughs> and that's real. Base.